For the second week of Lent, we are exploring Jesus' healing miracles. The artwork that we will be using this week to guide us through the Visio Divina is The Sun, painted in 1909 by Edvard Munch. Before we begin the prayer, I invite you into a moment of recentering. Find a quiet place, free of distraction. Sit comfortably in your chair and relax your shoulders. Release any tension that you notice yourself holding in your body. Gently close your eyes. As you do so, notice the breath within you. Gently inhale a deep breath. Slowly exhale as you make space for the spirit that flows through you. Return to your normal rhythm of breath taking with you a deeper awareness of God's presence. Loving God, as I enter into this time with you, clear my mind and guide my thoughts as you speak into my heart through this image. Hear these words from the Gospel of John, chapter four, verses 46 through 49, and John chapter five, verses two through nine. Then he came again to Cana in Galilee, where he had changed the water into wine. Now there was a royal official whose son lay ill in Capernaum. When he heard that Jesus had come from Judea to Galilee, he went and begged him to come down and heal his son for he was at the point of death. Then Jesus said to him, unless you see signs and wonders, you will not believe. The official said to him, sir, come down before my boy dies. Jesus said to him, go, your son will live. Now in Jerusalem by the sheep gate, there is a pool called in Hebrew, Bethesatha, which has five porticos. In these lay many invalids, blind, lame, and paralyzed. One man was there who had been ill for 38 years. When Jesus saw him lying there and knew that he had been there a long time, he said to him, do you want to be made well? The sick man answered him, Sir, I have no one to put me into the pool when the water is stirred up. And when I am making my way, someone else steps down ahead of me. Jesus said to him, Stand up, take your mat, and walk. At once the man was made well, and he took up his mat and began to walk. Gently open your eyes. As you gaze over the painting, allow your eyes to wander around the image. Notice where your eyes are drawn to in the painting. What aspects of the art capture you? Is there an element in the painting that attracts you? or perhaps repels you? Close your eyes and ask the question, what is inviting me to take a closer look? Open your eyes and look at the different aspects of the image. Allow it to draw forth a word, an emotion, or an image in your heart. What do you hear God whispering? What emotions do you feel?
Continue to gaze and reflect on what is being drawn forth. Close and rest your eyes, seeing that part of the image that is standing out in your mind. Slowly open your eyes. Gaze upon the sacred image one more time. Imagine yourself stepping into this sacred image. Step in and look around. What is God's invitation for you? Continue to look upon the image as you respond to God. Now close and rest your eyes. Open your eyes and let God lead as you listen for the words to emerge. You are now in relationship with this sacred image. How is it a part of your story? What stirrings does God's invitation invoke within you? Spend time journaling how you will take this invitation into your life. Rest in God's presence as long as you need to as you reflect on this prayer experience. Close by giving thanks to God. Go in peace.